There's a lot of expectations on teachers as they document children's learning. The first of those is a professional expectation that teachers understand what's happening in the learning environments that they coordinate and they can respond to those by planning curriculum experiences that can lead the children's learning. The second of those is an accountability expectation that comes from both the government and from the social and, and cultural context in which they're working. And really that's about teachers being accountable to the community for the work that they're doing with children and being able to speak back to the community about what they're doing and demonstrating that what, what is happening in their programs is of a high quality. The third thing that teachers need to be really aware of as they work with any new curriculum framework, particularly one that's mandated at a government level, is that there is a policy requirement or, le or a legislative requirement that they need to be participating in an assessment process and that often those assessment processes are identified for them within the curriculum documents. The way teachers manage assessment is really important. Assessment load is something that can become so heavy if it's not well managed that you fall underneath it. So teachers need to be really clear again about the purposes for their assessment and the processes they use to gather them. One of the really important things is to make sure that when you're assessing, you know why and that you're deliberately gathering information to support you in the work that you do. Assessment should help you do your job, not become something that makes it difficult for you to do your job. Thank you.